this morning I'm going to be making a raised bed from recycled material so these are leftover roofing material and these are some board that I'm going to be reusing along with some screws some screws and my screwdriver so let's go I'm going to be doing the two longer sides first I had made holes into the, the zinc, I believe it's zinc, in the roofing material prior to me screwing um, those screws. So I had already made some holes to accommodate the screws. I tell you, this thing gave me the fight of my life but you don't give up when it gets difficult you push and you push until you get it done eventually you'll get it done and the reward will be great at the end but this thing gave me a fight these wood are hard very very hard they don't make wood like this anymore, board like this anymore. Right. I'm almost done here. I'm almost done. Just one side left to go and it will be ready to placed in its new I'm going to put it um, up at the section where I extended the garden so once I attach this last piece then that's it it's done right here I have to um, kind of make an indentation in the board as it's extremely hard so I'm using a nail to make an indentation in the board so the screw is easier to go in. So this is where I'm going to be putting the raised bed. I'm going to get some more material now to fill it in and then I'll fill in my soil to plant in it All right, but before I do so I need to get myself a snack and get going alright one of my favorite snack to get in the garden is my cucumber let me see this one this one is ready but this one looks a bit big for me to snack on a smaller one this I'm going to share with the fam all right this one is perfect this is a perfect snack when you're in the garden why well it's perfect for me well the worm on my beetroot it's perfect for me because this is 96 percent water and in this heat, we need the hydration. So I'm just washing it with some ice water. Right, so I'm going to eat this cucumber and then I'm going to complete my project. Mm, perfect. These days are extremely hot and sweet. This is perfect. I saw a worm on my beetroot. Mm. Perfect. 
the seeds aren't developed so it's really nice to snack on and drink some water so good Refreshing. You'll be surprised to know how filling a cucumber is, even though it's mainly water, 96% water. Extremely filling. I'm going to get going. I need to get some stuff to fill in that bed. These will dry out and rot and provide some nutrients at the base of the bed. It might look bulky now, but it's not a lot when they're dried. And shrink right down into the bottom. Provide a nice rich base for my bed. Alright, so I'm going to put some soil in. to get some compost and manure some horse manure to put on top of that Then another layer of soil on top of this. This is going to be rich and nice. I'm going to plant um, some scallion or what you'd call bunching onion in here along with some 
red kidney beans. For this bed, that's it for this bed. So, this I made from these are leftover material, leftover roofing material, and and some leftover wood. I did it like this in case I need to cover the bed. So then I'll just put the mesh over for these, and I wouldn't have to be staking after it would be there already. So. I could cover it if I choose to and if not it'll just be there all right so that's it for for this bed I hope you enjoy this little project with me all right if you if you've not well I'd like to thank my my subscribers my viewers and subscribers if you've not already subscribed please consider um, consider to do so also like and share and leave a comment let me know what you think about my little project here all right thank you so and much remember grow what you eat eat what you grow mm.